हेलो एवरी वन आई एम वकाश सईद एंड टूडे वी आर कंटिन्यूइंग टू द थर्ड पार्ट ऑफ क्रोने मास फ्लोमीटर कन्वर्टर एम एफ सी फोर हंड्रेड मोड बस कम्युनिकेशन विद मोड बस पॉल सॉफ्टवेयर इन टूडे वीडियो वी विल सी द मोड बस आर एस फोर एट फाइव पैरामीटर सेटिंग ऑन द फ्लोमीटर साइट इफ यू इफ यू वॉन्ट टू चेंज द बेसिक आर एस फोर एट फाइव पैरामीटर ऑफ द फ्लोमीटर according to your existing rs485 network then this parameter setting learning is very important for you or if you do not know the exact rs485 parameter of flow meter you can check the parameter by the method we will learn today so let's see the parameter setting on the flow meter The front screen of Krone MFC 400 converter display the value along with the four button given through we go into the setting and check our Modbus RS485 parameters To enter into the flow meter setup you have to press hold it for the 2 second After holding this you enter into the setting options In setting you click on the upward direction find setup option and then enter into the setup options in setup option you find the device option and enter into the device option in device option you find the rs485 modbus option enter into the rs485 option when it is highlighted the first option you see is the slave address when you click enter on the slave address you can change the slave within the range of 1 to 247 you can put the slave address as per your choice or network requirement let's suppose i gave the slave address to 1 similarly for the baud rate it is given as 19200 you can change the baud rate according to your communication network need Similarly you can see the parity at the moment parity is even then we have data formatting option data format at the moment is big ndn then we have a transmission delay set at the moment it is at 0.0 millisecond and at the last we have stop it stop it is set as one stop it at the moment then after checking the setting we go out of the setup by pushing escape button before returning to the main screen it give us the option would you like to save the setting you press escape to save the setting thank you for watching this video in next video we will learn the real time simulation of modbus values on the modbus software by connecting the modbus converter with the laptop if you have any query regarding this video you can ask me in comment section or can directly contact me on my given number